Thank you for watching my channel. Please subscribe and like. Now back to the news. Julia Hart revealed she breezed her brother, who was 23 years her junior, and just a few months younger than her eldest daughter, after her mom asked her to. You wanna hear Ariel Minfke? I nursed my brother, she told Amanda Hirsch during Tuesday's episode of Not Skinny, But Not Fad. My mother's like oh, you're already nursing your daughter, take this one too, and so I ended up nursing my brother and my daughter. Now that's a Minfke. The fashion designer went on to explain that, at the time, she had just welcomed daughter Bathsheba, now 30, and her mom, who hasn't been identified, had given birth to Shlomo, now 29. Har was part of the Haredi community in New York, which is a group within Orthodox Judaism that is in opposition to modern practices and values. She ended up leaving the community in 2013 at the age of 42. The My Unorthodox Life star, 52, went on to compare her world to one where wet nurses existed during the interview. A wet nurse is a woman hired to breastfeed another woman's child, a practice that died in the 20th century. Hart also dubbed herself a time traveler, saying that people would need to travel to another time to understand the world I used to live in. When Hirsch asked the brazen, my unorthodox journey from long sleeves to lingerie author when she started questioning her beliefs, she admitted she had her entire life silently. She continued, but they had convinced me that I was somehow inherently flawed for not being okay with the system. However, the former lead model management CEO went on to admit it was her 23-year-old daughter, Miriam, who was the beginning and end of her exodus story, because she had come out as bisexual. No one could convince me that she was somehow flawed, she explained. When she started questioning the beliefs that's when I realized it's not only me, it's the system. During the interview, the Netflix star also shared that she was in an arranged marriage at the age of 19, to a sad man named Yasef Hendler, who she didn't want to be with. Despite being forced to marry him, Hart referred to her ex as a lovely man, adding that he was better than her second ex-husband, Silvio Scaglia, whom she married in 2020. The guy I was forced to marry is a much nicer one person than man I chose, Hart joked. Go figure that one out. 